This fancy box just came in the mail and that is the American Express Platinum card, the best card for travel. In this video, I wanna take it out of the box, show you what it looks like and go over the benefits to see if you might want to apply for the American Express Platinum card. As somebody who likes to travel as much as possible with my wife, Jenny, hopefully this card will prove that it is definitely worth the hefty annual fee of $695. So this is what the box looks like. I want you to have a good view of it. Obviously, I blurred out my uh, address so that you don't see it. It has the American Express logo on it, and it's very uh, fancy box. I've never got a box like this for any credit card I've gotten in the past. So why don't we uh, just start opening it? Okay, let's open this up. <laughs> All right, that was kind of a lot of work. All right, let's see here. All right, there it is. Welcome to Platinum. Unlock a world of experiences. This is what the card looks like. It's pretty nice in my opinion. So there we go, that's the card. And that's extremely heavy. I have never had a card, I don't think, to be this heavy before. And then that's what the back looks like. And there's the front, it looks pretty nice. Okay, these couple items came out of the box, but just to save time, I wanna do that just over to the side, but here we go. It says welcome on it. And there's really nothing too special on the back, but then on the back of some of these, they have the benefits right on there. So we'll get into that in a little bit. And then some more benefits right here and a lot more benefits right there. It is very expensive card. So I expect there to be some benefits. And then I haven't opened up this yet. I think it's just, uh, telling you all the terms, the card member agreement. Nothing too special there. Uh, there's additional benefits on that. Um, more of this, more of the terms. All right, nothing too special in that envelope, but let's get into some of the benefits. Since this is such an expensive credit card with a $695 annual fee, wanted to make sure we we're getting the most amount of benefits we could out of this card. One of the main ways you can do that is searching for the high signup bonus. If you go onto the American Express website and look at the platinum card, you can see that signing up right now is going to give you 100,000 bonus points for membership rewards. Now, I didn't know if this was good enough for me. I just wanted to wait around until I potentially saw a higher signup bonus. And I was actually targeted through the mail and high, you can see right here, it says 150,000 points for signing up. That is how many points I'm gonna get if I spend $6,000 in the first six months of having the credit card. Since this was so much bigger than the original signup bonus, I decided to give this a second thought and realize, okay, maybe this is actually something that I want to apply for. The website says this card is great for flights and hotels, something that we are doing all the time on this channel. We are flying to different countries as often as we can. We're staying in hotels just because that's where we have to be for the night. And it's also great for everyday rewards. This is one of the big benefits. It does not have a foreign transaction fee. We are out of the country a lot throughout the year. So this is going to help us immensely. There are other credit cards that offer no foreign transaction fee, but it's always nice when you're paying such a high fee that you can actually use this card in other places than just the United States. It says it's also great for luxury travel. We don't do a lot of luxury travel that often, but if some of the benefits pay for a little bit of that luxury travel, then maybe we'll start using a little bit of that in some of our videos. The first benefit that is listed on the American Express website, and it's a pretty big one, at least for us, it is five times points on hotels and flights booked through American Express Travel Portal. We have to book flights and hotels all of the time, so this is going to be extremely helpful for us to earn five points for every dollar that we spend on hotels and flights. Now, of course, other credit cards offer something very similar to this. I have the Chase Freedom Flex right now, and if you book through Chase, you also get five times points with that card. So not really a huge benefit here to using American Express Travel, but at least you can kind of price match and find the best option. So if 
Amex happens to have a cheaper option than Chase, then we'll definitely go with that. The annual fee on my Chase card is actually zero dollars. That's probably why I would favor that card over this one. And you may start to think, okay, well, then that's not even worth it if you can get a no annual fee card and get the same exact benefits. But this credit card has so much more to offer that I do think it will be worth it for us and maybe for you. The next one is a $200 annual credit that you can use for hotels. Unfortunately, you cannot use this for every hotel that you want to stay at. There are very specific ones here on the website listed that you can use. I know that some people like to find cheap hotels in that collection, and so they're hardly spending any money on that. You just get a free $200. I don't know how useful this will be because, like I said, you can only use it at select hotels, so we'll just have to move on to the next benefit. $200 annual airline fee credit. This one will be useful because you can use it for things like checked bags or food you buy on a plane. This is not just a $200 just general airline credit. You have to select a specific airline at the start of the year so that you can uh, start charging your money to your card for that airline and then you can use up to $200 and get that for free. I think we will definitely use this every single year. Sometimes we are just traveling with our carry-ons and other times when we're going to cold places we might need a huge bag to hold all of our heavy jackets and so we will have to check baggage that way and if we're just on multiple flights with the same airline this will definitely come in handy. $155 Walmart Plus credit. This will help pay the $12.95 monthly fee that it costs to be a part of Walmart Plus. I don't really see huge benefit in this other than filling up at gas stations you can get 10 cents off per gallon at Walmart stations and I believe Sam's Club and a few others. You also get Paramount Plus for free and you get free delivery from Walmart if you want that. There are some other options too that you can get for free for Walmart Plus. It's not a huge use to us but it can still help us get at least like $50 to $100 worth of value every single year. There hasn't been a ton of value so far to justify that $695 annual fee, but the big thing I wanna talk about is airport lounges. That's coming up in a little bit, but one of the other big things is the $240 entertainment credit. This will pay for things like ESPN+, Plus, Hulu, Disney+, Plus, or just the whole Disney bundle of all three of those, or Sirius XM, or Audible. Two of the other ones that can help for the statement credit is Peacock and the New York Times subscription. You get a $20 statement credit every single month, and so even though we didn't have to get Peacock, even though we didn't have to get the Disney bundle, we get it for free anyway, so we might as well take advantage of it. Get Hulu, get Disney+, Plus, get ESPN+, Plus, and get Peacock all for free essentially. Just use the card and then they will give us a statement credit after they see those purchases on the card up to $20 every single month. $200 Uber cash every single year. This is helpful. It's $15 every single month and I believe that they up that in December to give you additional credit on there. This is going to be helpful for just like getting an Uber when we're in another country or when we're at home and maybe we'll Order Uber Eats. I know that the fees are pretty high on those services, but with $15 for free, that is pretty nice. We'll use it at least once per month. There was a $300 Equinox credit, Equinox Gyms. There's not that many. I didn't even know about it until I applied for this card. It's basically of no use to me since I cannot get an Equinox subscription. The closest gym is probably hundreds of miles away, so it's not even useful for me at all. We'll just take that out. $300 Soul Cycle credit, that's of really no use to me. I don't even really know what that is. So we'll move on to the next one, which is airport lounges. This is where a huge amount of the money and value is going to come for this card, at least for me and my wife, that we are traveling all the time and we are at airports pretty frequently. We are spending a lot of money in airports, just eating lunch, eating dinner, maybe even multiple meals and we are just extremely uncomfortable sitting on those hard chairs. Maybe there's not even any seating available, but if we can go to an airport lounge when we're in there, it is so nice. We get free food. We are going to have a spot to sit. We can work. They have great Wi-Fi in there because the Wi-Fi is often pretty bad in most airports, especially internationally. It's just so hard to get work done when you're just trying to film all these YouTube videos, edit them, and get them posted. It's just 
so much work we have to do if we have a long layover and we wish we could get it done and now we can now that we are in a lounge with the credit card. This gives us access to the Centurion lounges, Lufthansa, Delta. There's Priority Pass, which gets you into over 1,400 lounges worldwide. Uh, of course, this is definitely a luxury card, I guess. Uh, being in an airport lounge is a luxury item that you can have and purchase for quite a bit of money or have a credit card that gets you in for free. This is a huge value for us. It's just going to help us a lot with our business and with our traveling in general. There's also a $189 clear credit. This is going to be helpful because it'll get us through security significantly faster and we get to go to the lounge even sooner so that we can start working. As you can see, there's a lot of practical use in this. We're not just blowing $700 a year just because we can. It's actually going to be extremely useful to use in our business, something that we hope is going to help make this YouTube channel even better and also our Instagram as well. And it'll just be a more enjoyable experience to be traveling because being at the airports is probably one of our least favorite parts about traveling. So if we can help clear that up, make things a little bit more smooth, get more work done, we're gonna be a lot happier and we can make better videos for you. And of course, it's going to be nice to get that sign up bonus of 150,000 membership rewards points, but that's only if we spend $6,000 in the first six months. Now we're gonna to have to book a lot of flights, a lot of hotels to make sure we spend $6,000 in the first six months, and then we can use these points to book other flights and other hotels. If you also want to sign up for this card, if this is interesting at all, I believe we'll have a referral link in the description if you want to sign up. But of course, make sure that it's actually worth it for you and you're not spending $695 just for fun. Thank you so much for watching this video. We'll see you in the next one.